My name is Phil Bataganyo, a young digital activist from the Kenya Platform on Climate Governance. It is projected that by 2030, 75% of Africa's population will be below the age of 35. Why am I giving this statistic? This shows that the future of Africa is youthful, is composed of the young people. Some of the assets that young people have demonstrated, as we've seen uh, young people taking a leading role in climate action, from Greta Thunberg uh, from, uh, of Sweden, who was the face of the, the 2020 climate strike, to Vanessa Nakate, our own from Uganda, we have seen amazing initiatives and activities by young people. Well, some of the assets that they have, they have uh, to boost their, in, their involvement include self-mobilizing and amazing uh, mob, uh, organizing capabilities. And we've seen this in some of the initiatives that young people have led. We've also seen a lot of energy and valve that young people have demonstrated uh, as they coordinate functions and uh, activities around the globe. Closer home in Africa, we have seen uh, initiatives like the uh, African Youth Initiative on Climate Change doing amazing initiatives and activities around uh, climate action. They have simply uh, mastered the art of self-mobilizing to, to be able to carry out amazing initiatives. Now, one of the major successes that we take a lot of pride in as an initiative is the Young Digital Activists platform, uh, which has been supported massively by Pakja. Now, this is a platform that has enabled young people to self-organize and to be able to use uh, and to harness the power of social media and the dynamic energies of the young people in order to advocate for climate uh, action. And we take a lot of pride in this because we have seen some of the energies and some of the innovative uh, ideas of young people in gathering and uh, disseminating information around climate action, thanks to this initiative of the young digital activists. Now, as we emerge from the global pandemic of the COVID-19, and we see many countries adopting the policies of building back better, my appeal is for the journalists and the media, the fourth estate, of course, we are celebrating journalism and digital, uh, digital journalism has taken a center stage even during the ESA Awards. My appeal would be for the media and the fourth estate to, to give space for more youthful stories, for more stories on climate change and environment from the lenses of the young people. Why is this? Because young people have the masses, they have the presence and they have the numbers on social media. And most of our digital platforms have youth in their largest of numbers. I would want to request and to appeal in a very special way to the fourth estate, to the media, to give space for these stories to take center stage. Why? Because the future, in the words of Julius Malema, the young people have time on their side. The future is becoming a bit more personal because young people have that future. Thank you.